hello this is kind of terrible lighting kind of not i have just come off of sprints it is saturday of like the easter bank holiday weekend it is 20 to 11 but i picked up until the end by derek landy which is the 15th and final book of skullduggery pleasant the series i've been reading with the dead famous read along with Hannah over at Lydia M, Abby from Abby of Pelennor, and Becca from The Book Sanctum. All of those will be li linked down the below, as well as the playlist for The Dead Famous Free Long if you want to catch up with all our live shows. But in the live, I read 175 pages, and it's the last book. I don't trust anything that's going on. I don't trust Valkyrie. I don't trust Skullduggery. The only person I trust at the moment is Omen Darkly and Sebastian Tao. <laughs> For very different reasons, but I will always trust Omen because Omen is a sweetheart and he's finally showing his worth. And obviously Sebastian is just great and he is always honest, as far as I can tell, even though I don't think he's telling the truth about who he is. And I'm really enjoying it. It's a lot of fun already and I'm not sure. I've already missed, so I also read the grimoire recently, like today I finished it. And I've already missed references apparently to it. There's one that I've picked up on now. I think the cat just tried to get in. But also it could be a weird housemate. Either way, that was creepy as shit. Come on, did you have to be as creepy as that, Percy? But yes, skull ducks. And I'm hoping to finish it tomorrow. Eww. Only 400 pages to go, huh? So I'm standing on the creakiest fucking floorboard. But I thought I would take you along on the journey with me. I'm going to read for about another hour. And then I'm going to go to sleep, I think. Right, I'm on page 208. I haven't really, I haven't read for an hour. I read for about... 20 minutes actually but I am going to do some more reading now and I will check in with you in the morning when I wake up when we wake hear the birds and see the sun side by side our fears are done all the good times just begun good morning it is Sunday morning it is Easter Sunday and it is 20 to 11. I've been up since about 7ish, quarter past 7. And I played some Animal Crossing. Very important because I've got my turnips. <laughs> and I've been listening to the audiobook of Until the End. And I'm now going to go downstairs to read physically. But I've got to 63% and oh, it's getting good. I'm now back on Sebastian being Omen. Omen. Omen rather than Orga again because there's been a couple of lines where I'm like ooh hinty hinty hint hint but I'm very excited for that reveal. Happy fun times are being had by all. So yeah I'm going to go chill downstairs and yeah. Ooh, I'm scared to see how this is gonna end. Okay. Okay. It's ten past three. I'm 74% of the way through. I'm definitely gonna finish it today I've got around just under 200 pages left I don't do I don't know maths I'm terrible and I am sitting here with Hannah who's still reading it as well she's a little bit behind me not by as much not not by much at all and I'm just very much not sure what is happening but this is the best Easter Sunday I could ever have. I'm not forced to go on a walk, which I normally am, so <laughs> lazy. And I'm spending my Easter with Skullduggery Pleasant, and I'm not mad about it. Call us crazy, but things are finally right. With you and I, the future is bright. Derek Landy Day and Hannah is concentrating. National Derek Landy Day! <laughs> <laughs> International Derek Landy Day! In math. In math. 
Hannah is kindly driving, but also Hannah is going into the background with her bail out. It's very funny. I'm very white. <laughs> and now we have a uh, goblin in the back there. <laughs> <laughs> and we're having a day out in bar. Whoa, uh, that is a lot of light on my face. There we go. <laughs> so, yes. It's a goose. A goose. <laughs> get a, get a shot of the goose. Even in the hard time, you and I can weather any storm. Before I sleep, hear the crickets, see the moon. Side by side and through and through. To what we can do Oh, we know what we have Let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy But things are finally right I'm very we got We got in the queue at the right time Because, I mean, that doesn't look bad But, um... The queue loops. So we just met Derek Landy and Erin and my feet hurt because we were <laughs> we're wearing fancy shoes. We're wearing fancy shoes. So Hannah's left us here to get the girl. You want to see our shoes? <laughs> uh, <laughs> stubby little leg. There it is. Um. <laughs> so. That was fun. He was really nice, though, Derek Landy. He was. He was you should, you should uh, definitely say hello if you see him on the street. That was a really weird thing for me to say. <laughs> Don't but harass him, but say hello. <laughs> he's a really cool guy, and he told me he didn't like he doesn't bring people back because he um, tortures them. And I'm saying nothing because Erin hasn't hasn't read it. But then I think Erin may have heard my question. So. Oh, hang on, where's he? He made a little skull. Look at that. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Anywho. End of clip. End of clip. Okay, so it is Tuesday afternoon and I look a bit like a mess because I've been at work all day. But I just wanted to go through some of the stuff that I got yesterday. And as you saw, no, you don't think you did. We went to Toppings in Bath and weirdly enough, uh, bumped into Beth from Brooks Nest and Brit from Basically Brit and they were absolutely lovely. I'll pop a photo here, but it was really bizarre because it's I didn't know she was going to be there and we were there for the signing. So that was amazing. They were both really, really nice. It was just really nice to have a chat rather than having a chat over the internet. But coincidentally, while we were at uh, Toppings, I picked up Mischief Acts and this is a Korean story. I don't really know what it's about. It's a historical novel. It's before, it's set before the North-South divide happens, and there's shapeshifters and stuff in it. So that's really cool. And I wanted a fancy topping with this, a uh, fancy edition with this toppings thingy. Uh, and Hannah very kindly bought me this book. So very nice of Hannah to buy it, and it's very shiny, which is very nice. And then at the tour, we got some cool badges so on this one it's the front cover and this one says until the end which is kind of amazing and then we got a skullduggery postcard and then I got three book signs so this is the first one and the dead one I also got the Maleficent 7 signed because I love Tanner. Now is that one. And then of course we also got this edition, which is the signed edition. Oh while we're here. This is the tour poster which I hold upside down. 
which is really cool. And then it's already signed there, and then also got it signed here. And <laughs> I, he was very nice, Derek Landy. He was lovely, and he was just so smiley, and it was just a really nice experience overall. And I'm so excited to see what the future holds for Skullduggery and Valkyrie. It's a great book, great series. If you haven't picked it up yet, you should. So, if you're still here, thank you very much for watching. Tell me how you have got on with Skullduggery Pleasant, or if you haven't started yet and you're thinking about doing so, let me know down in the comments, and I will see you in my next video. Thanks, guys. Bye. Mm -hmm.